This is Jerigon Missy from the Adamson Soaring Falcons, and this is where I'm from. I entered Adamson 2016. Yeah, it was just a great experience to be here at Adamson. It was a great, um, you know, coming from humble beginnings, because Manila is like downtown, it's like the ghetto area of the Philippines. So, uh, you know, this, this place really humbles you. This place really, you know, creates memories that can last a lifetime. Uh, this is the gym back there, the, where we practice every day and from nine to 12. Uh, th that's where the gym where we literally worked our butts off to uh, get to the Final Four every single year. And um, that was the place where Coach France just pushed everybody to be better, to be better players, be better men. And uh, yeah, there was a lot of memories there that, uh, you know, that went through my mind and just a lot of experiences as well. <laughs> It's like a good memory and a bad memory at the same time, but uh, it's the Final Four against UP, and uh, unfortunately we didn't win, but uh, the second game, the game two, the Araneta crowd was sold out, I think, over 22,000 people, 23,000 people, and history was broken. It's just one of those experiences that you can never really get back, and you can really, really never tell to anybody unless you experience it yourself. Uh, after practice, we usually walk over here on the street. You know, just walk. If we're gonna go to the dorm, or if we're gonna go to the SV canteen and the SV hall, we usually walk over here. Even out here on the quad, there's people who just sit down and just, you know, enjoy nature, because there's a lot of trees. And it's also a nice view out in the front of uh, the school, so uh, this is where everybody usually just walks to get to class. You walk through the classes and everybody notices you, everybody tries to, you know, pop on scene like that, try to notice, it makes you notice them. And then also here at the SV Canteen, uh, that's where usually all the athletes go and even some of the students that you see around school You know, uh, they, they go there sometimes to just grab a bite to eat chop it up and just just hang out with everybody And over there by the dorm uh, In front of the dorm there. That's where the Kainan was the street food the finger food um, that's where all of the students and some of the athletes as well hung out to just pass time and just to, you know, get, get some food in their stomach uh, before going to class and going to practice as well. That's the dorm right there. Uh, that's where all the athletes usually stay, I think basketball and men's volleyball, they all stay in that dorm. And uh, you know, that's just where we bond. That's where we, we can literally invade somebody else's room without them questioning it because we all live together. So that's where all the memories were really made. I think that's a good word for Adamson. I think that's a good word to describe just the street, the, the surroundings, the neighborhood about uh, Adamson. Uh, it's a really welcoming place. It's really humble to come from a place where you know, not many people 
have the chance to go to school, or not that many people have a chance to play basketball around here. So, you know, uh, being a Falcon is more than just coming to the school, and you know, it's more about like loyalty, or just, you know, uh, making sure that everybody in your community is feeling welcome. And uh, I think that being a Falcon just really, it really catches your soul, really, rather than just being around with uh, other people. This is Jerrica Hamisi from the Adamson Soaring Falcons, and this is where I'm from.